Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Please subscribe, click the bell, and click all to get all notifications. If you have any tech questions, please click the Discord link. Hello, today I'm going to show you how to run Linux apps on a Windows 10 machine. Uh, graphical uh, user interface or GUI apps from Linux to this machine, uh, this Windows 10 machine. Um, recently I think they added it even better support, but it's still in preview. So right now I'm not going to use anything experimental. Uh, they call it like the, the preview branches of Microsoft stuff. I don't think some of that stuff's on there yet. I could be wrong. If I am, throw it down in the comments and maybe I'll try to do another video where I don't use this. But this is basically um, an X server that runs. So this is called GWSL. And basically it's just an X server that runs on this machine. And I'll put this link in the description. And then you'll get this in the store and install it. And then you'll get this uh, this um, program here. And you'll see X running on localhost 0, 0.0. So the next thing you want to do is get your IP address of your local machine. So mine is right here, 192.168.1. .208, and you want to build this command. It's just called export display, put the IP address, and then put 0.0. .0. Then we're going to load up the terminal from here. So I click this and then did Linux shell, and it brings up this terminal. And the first thing I want to do is install a GUI graphical user interface program. And the one I use the most is called git k. So I just do apt get update and then apt get install git k. And I use this. Git k is a graphical user interface for looking at git commits and other information. So you can see I already have it installed. I'm going to hit control D to go back to this normal user here. So I'm back to the YouTube user here. I'm going to export this display. And then I'm going to get some code from GitHub. If you go to github.com slash the chef 17, click YouTube, hit this clone or this code button, then copy this link. <coughs> come back down to the YouTube window and I actually have it here already as you can see in here and then if you come in Vim and then I can just do git k the file I want to look at and I know let's say I want to look at this Vim um, p py example and you can see the first commit of this was 9-8-2015 and this is the initial commit of this program that I wrote. You can actually see this Juan Flores actually helped me out and patched this. Uh, recently, you can see that this started needing this um, this Git submodule update. So he patched this, and now it actually works better. And that's what's really nice about GitHub. So that's how you can run uh, a Linux GUI or graphical user interface uh, program on a Windows 10 machine. And uh, there's many other, of course, uh, graphical programs on Linux. Uh, Git K is just one of them, and you can just apt get any one of them here and use them just like you would on any other machine. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and talk to you soon.